So you can kind of see it. I, I do have a shirt on, guys. I'm not Nike down here. I would never because something would accidentally show. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, I'm doing a little bit of a different video. <laughs> um, I am doing a video about like my headspace with YouTube, but also more so just kind of like talking with you guys because it kind of helps me work through what I'm feeling and um, it's, it's really nice to come and talk to you guys because I don't really know if you guys get it, but like you're a part of this YouTube community as much as I am, so like you get it more than my boyfriend. That's why I'm talking to you. Sometimes I may prefer you more than him. Just kidding. So here's where I'm at. This is just kind of like a chit chat. I'm just with the goals and the guys, and I'm drinking some water, almost choking on water, and having some chip dip. So. I want my channel to be more. I love makeup videos. Watch them all the time. That's how I got interested in starting my own channel. I started watching Shane Dawson, Graveyard Girl, Molly Burt, and I, I think I want more. Not think, I know. I want my channel to still be a place where people can come and escape reality. I still want that and I feel like that's what I offer you guys I'm goofy I'm weird I talk about makeup um, I'm you know a fun space I hope in my opinion to come to and I don't want that to be gone I want that to stay I, I love what Bethany Moda does I love what Rach loves life does um, because she has Rachel Loves and Rachel Loves Life. I had to remember which was which. Rachel Loves Life is where she does more things about organization and decorating and things like that. Pinterest. And Bethany Moda does, you know, try on hauls and um, goofy expectation versus reality, Pinterest, DIYs, all of that fun stuff. And I love those things. And honestly, I think a part of me would like to go into that direction as well. But then I watch when Shane Dawson posts a video and I'm like, that means something. Not that the other ones don't mean something, but it's like really like real. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's just a little different. It's like a whole production. It's like a reality TV show. It's helping people. It's, you know, giving people spotlight light that doesn't normally get spotlight, helping them with their YouTube channel and their journey and getting back on track and feeling that that love <laughs> that they once felt about YouTube. And not while I, I don't have pull with people, I don't know people, I'm not big enough to help people. I kind of want something a little more serious. You know what I mean? I'm not trying to offend people because I do makeup videos. That is how I started my channel and I don't, at this time, I don't feel that I want that to stop. I want that to continue. What I think is I don't want that to be everything. I want to talk about real life issues, some that I am passionate about or some that I have uh, been in myself. Um, I. I <laughs> My dream channel is to be like Bethany Moda, but with this like serious side as well. So I, I, at this time, I'm really confused about where I want my channel to go. Um, and I felt this way for a while, but makeup videos are my bread and butter. It's what my comfort zone is. It's what I'm used to. So I stick with that because I just don't know. I just don't know how to execute it. I don't know how to get it do it. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to talk about. I just don't know. And I mean, that's okay. I'm just trying to figure this out. What I want is your guys' suggestions. I want to hear what you guys think, what you want to see. Do you want to see just makeup? Is that the only reason that you're here? Or do you want something a little bit more serious? Do you want a mix of both? Do you want more DIYs? Do you want more pictures? And it's, it's not that like, I've lost my love for making videos because I totally love sitting down here and talking with all my little lovelies right here but I've kind of lost that creativity I got it back when Shane did his video with Grey Hair Girl and I kind of lost that and um it made me feel a little more inspired to do more so when I did my house tour that was me being a little bit more open about something I'm insecure about 
And I want to continue that. I, I want to do that sort of stuff on here as well. So I, in my head, I think I want some makeup, some DIY, some Pinterest, some of this, some serious stuff. I'm talking about this, talking about that. God, I love conspiracy theories, but I just don't think I could throw that into this wheel brain yet. So that's kind of like where I'm at. So I guess this is also my heads up. Like, hey guys, I might be doing something a little different on my channel. I hope you like it. But also a talk with me about it. Comment down below what, sh what you want to see because I don't really know what you guys want to see. Um, I've been on YouTube for a year and I'm not saying that it's all about money. I, I've never said that and I'm, I'm not saying it's about growth and having all these subscribers. But I mean, like I would like to do that. My ideal goal is to sometime in my life do this as my job full time. This is what I'm doing. And in order to do that, you need views, you need subscribers, you need those to be modernized to get money so you could do this as a full-time job. That is what you need. And I guess my frustration a little bit is YouTube is changing, we're all getting used to it. From what I've understood, I personally came into YouTube at a weird time in this transition and when things got really weird with ads and really weird with YouTube's algorithm and how they're pushing it. And I think that all of us are just trying to figure that out. Um, I hear other YouTubers that I watch talk about this as well on their channel, like what they're doing isn't working. It's not getting views, it's not bringing people in and they don't understand why. And I, t I get that because I feel like I put my heart and soul into a video and I absolutely love it. Like I think it is freaking awesome. And I get like 15 views on it. What is that about? But you know, then you can like do a giveaway and you get 2,000 views on it, which for me is a lot. And uh, I just, I know that why that's bringing in people and it's not bringing in the proper attention that I want, which is why I pulled back on giveaways on my channel. But besides that, like, I'm not the only person that struggles with this and I'm not the only, only person that doesn't understand why it's like this. And it's, it's cultivating a weird shift in some people. Like what we portray is what you guys receive and that's what you think of us. That is natural because that is what we're doing purposefully. I want to be more than makeup. Not that there's anything wrong with that. That's just not if I'm looking five, 10 years from now. That's not what I want, I think to be my whole like explanation. So when you hear Danielle Eves or you hear Danny Loons, I don't want to be makeup. I want it to be makeup and whatever I'm trying to figure out. <laughs> I want it to be, oh, I love her. She does awesome makeup videos, but she also talks about real life issues or she really helped me with my anxiety or my depression that I was feeling or she really helped me with figuring out how to freaking de decorate my house and follow Pinterest recipes like you know that's kind of what I think I want um I had somebody she she did no ill intentions she did it out of the kindness of her heart and I'm so thankful and I, I need to message her I need to do that <laughs> um, but she sent me a video that she created and it was about her favorite youtubers and why she liked them and she likes me because I'm goofy and because I do unboxing videos. I think that was the sweetest thing that she mentioned to me in her video and this is not against her at all, but then I was left with the taste in my mouth of her perception of me is goofy, which is good because I want that for you guys because that's who I am and I think that you guys like that and you like that I'm myself because I, I am being myself, but unboxing videos is kind of what like lingered. <laughs> and I am more than unboxing videos, you know, like I'm just a more of a person than that. And I think that was also my second wake up call of like, maybe I should be doing more. Maybe I should be doing something a little bit more serious, a little bit more real world things. Maybe just not unboxing videos. Um, because again, like I said, I don't want to be known as Danielle Makeup. I want to be known as Danielle Makeup and fill in the word right here for me down below in the comments. <laughs> and I think that's just where I'm at right now. And I hope that you guys are on board with this transition that I'm wanting to go through. 
But I also want you guys to hold me accountable. I want you guys, three weeks from now, when I'm going back to my roots and going back to my comfort zone of makeup videos, and I want you to call me out and say, Danielle, you said you wanted to change. You said you wanted to be more than just makeup, and here you are doing just makeup, and you need to be more than makeup because that's what you want. And I want you to call me out on it, okay? Because I need that. <laughs> I need you guys to hold me accountable because I know myself well enough to know that I will feel stressed to put out a video and I'll just do some, you know, quick tutorial, review a product, like something like that. And I don't want that to just be what you see on my channel. So hold me accountable. Hold me accountable, please, please, please. Like I'm literally begging you. You can tell me, Danielle, you are effing up what you want. <laughs> okay. Okay. And then I'll, you know, just gotta light a little fire underneath me and I always, you know, this is a total sign note about me. I wouldn't get mad at you. But usually, like, someone will, like, throw something at me and I'll be mad because I'm like, I'm not doing that. I'm better than that. It's not my fault. And then, like, an hour later, I calm down. I'm not as mad anymore. I'm like, okay, time to get it done. And that's just my personality. Hold me accountable, please. That's what I really want. I want your opinions. Tell me what you want to see. Is it just makeup? Do you just want to see makeup stuff? Or... Do you want it to be more? I want more. Is that a song? Like the Little Mermaid? I want it all. But that is everything for this video, and I hope that you liked this video. If you did, please make sure that you give it a big old thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that little notification bell so you don't miss my videos because, like I said, YouTube algorithm is weird, and you won't see them if you don't have that notification bell on. So, please. And I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for listening, and I love you guys. Bye.